this one. I've got two glow sticks in case we want something happens for me. So what I'll do, Michael, is I'll play on one and get it set up for you. And then I'll put the other glow stick in so you can be able to play on a glow stick that hasn't been played like in weeks. So you won't have to have too much hemp on here for the warm weather. Still a little too much. Yeah, I didn't have enough money saved up to attempt to even buy a cheap Celtic harp, so I just sent my. Have you ever heard of Tim Britton, Michael, on yeah. Ellen Piper? I'd been emailing him and he was too busy to make a read. He said to contact him at the end of July, so I did. He's got time now, so I just shipped my Ellen Pipe Channer, my old read and stuff, insured for a thousand bucks to Tim Britton, so sometime in the next month or so I should have a good Ellen Pipe read. Hmm. Uh, what I'm doing right now, Michael, is I'm taking extra hemp off my spare wall stick it won't quite fit. Can you hear that? Yeah. Um, yeah. So that you get a good seal when you try to play the drones here. And I wonder how the, how the chanter stock doesn't leak the bag and stuff. I've, I've, I'll have to, uh, I won't be here in a real while. I've got my hair plugs in. I don't I have like, the kind. You like, can ask the question later, right. okay? Like, how so, does the. So, the low stick you're going to play is all set now. I'm going to ask the question later because you have earplugs ear in. in. Yep. Okay. I did have earplugs like those, but I lost them at a gig. And he said he doesn't like these, but these are the best ones. I'm going to have to uh, be ready for loud noise, Michael. i got to play the channel a little bit. Still wet from me playing at Riverside yesterday. Well, that's a, I have to have these so they're loose when they're dry from the heat. Because by the time I get done playing for an hour, I can't. I can almost not get the channel out without breaking. It, it swells up so much. Mm -hmm. But then you can't leave it too loose when you first start playing, or everything falls out and breaks. The chair slows up. Yeah. <sighs> Alright. Now we'll put the spare blow stick in that's all dry and should be germ free and And I've never Okay. There's put those on your shoulder. And the blow stick's going to be a bit short for you, because I'm short. <laughs> that's, that's how they stay, okay? Yeah, they just hang out there. So do short, short puffs of air. You're going to have to 
It's going to take a while. That's the dry system that's in there. I don't even have it hooked up to my channel anymore. Only to the drone reeds. So just... Oh. Yeah, just do short puffs and take your time. It's going to take a while to blow it up. And So just a minute while I put the reed protector back on so don't damage the reed. Okay, let's, oops, you know what, let's see, where are my big Those drones don't seem like they're all over, all on one shoulder. Well, they're not because you're, you're not, your shoulder isn't big enough. They can't, they won't fit on your shoulders. Oh, oh. phooey, where am I? I forgot, I've only got small corks in my hand. I know I have big corks somewhere, but... Is that plastic right I there? I never use them. Uh, yeah. Or is what that metal? I, I thought that was metal. Right. Uh, no. No. Right here is metal. You know what? Or this, I'll use my okay. thumb. Ready? Find your blow stick. I have no idea where my big corks are. Yep, blow sticks here. because it doesn't have enough air pressure. You almost got it, and then, let's see, you want to have a blow stick like that. Yeah. Yeah, you got to blow really hard, pushing your diaphragm. the steady tone. Mm -hmm. Now if the channel was in there you would need about three times the amount of air and air pressure that you're doing right now. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> so like, even now it's a little, the drones seem a little out of tune. Well you gotta blow. Come on. You gotta keep enough air in there. The other thing is they're all set up, not that they're perfectly in tune because we didn't even warm up or tune, but they're also set up to, um, you have to be at the pressure that you need to play the chanter, mm -hmm. and of course at any lower pressure they're going to be out of tune even if they've been tuned perfectly. I'll get my earplugs out so I can hear. There, can you hear now? Mm-hmm. So what would you think? Um, I think it was a little bit. Hard, but not much. Well, that was only the drones, remember? You gotta do three times more to the other channel. Yeah, right. I can't even, with the current setup I have, Michael, I can't even play for a full hour. I used to be able to play for an hour and a half, two hours. Is that partly because your drone reads are really hard to blow? 
Um, yeah, yeah, because I'm playing a hard channel read and, and the uh, the good Cunard drone reads. So they make the reads that are, um, they make a bass drone that's easier to play. 